Hi y'all, it's Beth here and I'm so excited to be sharing with you today a Knowles Farm Scents haul. And this is my very first order ever from Knowles Farm Scents and I'm so excited. This was part of the um, Roadshow pre-order from Knowles Farm Scents and the owner I think is named Travis. Um... Yeah, the owner's name is Travis from Knowles Farm Scents, and so without any further ado, I'm going to go ahead and get into it because I am so excited. Um, there are, I think, two scents that have already been poured like a month ago, so yeah, I'm very, very excited because they should already be ready to warm those two. So first off, he did send a business card. So that has Facebook, Instagram, website, and his email address. And then also there is this um, little book that says Knowles Farm Scents Handcrafted Scent Wax Products Established 2018. Thank you with a little heart. And then when you open it up, it has just different information about warming the wax and everything, tells me to take a picture and tag him, and then um, a little handwritten note, which is very nice. Yeah, so I'm very thankful for this little booklet. I did already read it. It just gives like some helpful tips on if you want it to be not as strong, but last longer or stronger, but last a shorter time and, um, you know, like how long to melt the wax for and stuff like that. So very helpful information. And then um, he sent two samples. So this first one is in the scent Bibby Boo. And the notes are strawberry, raspberry, pineapple, sugar cane, sponge sugar, and vanilla. And all of his wax seems to have the pour date on it which is so helpful. This is just a very good, sweet, fruity scent, and I'm very, very excited to give it a try. And then the second sample, this is in the scent Velvet Dawn, and the notes are Jasmine, Saffron, Fir, Cedar, and Amber. So this is like a, um outdoorsy, um, perfumey, cologne type of scent for sure. So definitely two very different scents of samples um, in this order. So a good variety. And then without any further ado, I'll get into the brittles that I ordered. I think he calls these brittles and I ordered seven of them. So um, you'll notice a theme with them. They're mostly fruity and bakery. So this first one, this is in the scent Summer Scoop. This one, the notes are fruit, banana, peach, vanilla, caramelized sugar, and sponge sugar. And this one was poured May 14th, so it should already be ready to warm. I mean, his little booklet says everything's ready to warm straight out of the box, but that it only gets better with age. So it's been curing for a month now, and... That's kind of my rule that I have for myself with vendor wax is like let it sit for a month before you try it. Um, so yeah, this one has definitely sat for a month and ready to warm. Then this next one, it was poured on May 18th. Um, so it'll be ready, it'll be poured a month ago in about three days. And this one is in the scent Cheat Day. And the notes are strawberry pound cake, sugar cookie royale, and birthday cake. Mm, that one's so good. I really enjoy that one. And then I have the scent Three is Company. This one was poured on May 20th. Three is Company. And the notes are strawberry pound cake, strawberry patch, cupcakes at Tiffany's. This one is so good. I definitely get that very sweet strawberry note from the strawberry patch blended with the bakery. That smells so good. I have the scent Strawberry Shake Up. This one was poured on May 23rd and the notes are strawberry patch and lemonade and this one smells just like a very sweet strawberry lemonade. 
It smells really good. I'm excited for this one. It's probably one of my favorites on cold, but honestly, all of these smell really amazing on cold. This next one was poured June 3rd, and this is in the scent Sweet Treats on the Midway. The notes are County Fair and Strawberry Pound Cake. Oh, this is so good. The County Fair definitely has a like apple and a caramel. It smells really, really good. Then this next one was poured on May 30th. This is in the scent I Heart Carbs. And the notes are sugar cookie dough, fresh baked bread, and vanilla custard. This one is good. It's like a sweet bread note, sweet bread scent. And then the last scent that I have to share with you guys, this is in the scent Lemon Birthday Cake, and it was poured on May 22nd. And it is Lemon Chiffon and Birthday Cake. Yeah, this one is very good. Very sweet, lemony cake scent. So, yeah, that's everything. He also sent an invoice, which I didn't look at. But I will let you guys know if it has the prices on them. How much each of them were. Uh, yeah, it does have the prices on them. So it's it was seven dollars and seventy five cents per brittle, so um, not bad at all. And I I wish I remembered how many ounces of wax it was in each brittle, but I can't remember. So um, yeah, and then it was packaged up so nicely. He uses these little brown paper squiggles in his boxes, so. Yeah, I am very, very pleased with this order. So excited to mount these scents. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time. And as always, make sure you stay positive till then. Bye.